Zen Studio also comes with some power, power tools in the main menu. In the corner here, you will see there are some uh, reveal functions. You see here, you can either drag where you would like to reveal or spotlight certain aspects on the screen, and then you can move that uh, spotlight around for effect in the classroom. Double click uh, removes that function. The second one is the screen cover. When in the screen cover, it gives you several ways of interacting. One, you can simply drag the screen around as you please. Secondly, you can use the tabs on the side to drag up and down again as, you're, as you require. Next, we have the capture tool. In this case, we're going to capture something from the web. It may be an image, it may be some text. You can simply drag and then come back to your, come back to your file and drag the, uh, the file or the image or the text quite simply onto your page. Next to that, you will see here the on-screen keyboard, which is very handy and easy to use. And then I'll create a new page to show you the following tool, which is the ruler. The ruler is quite a uh, very useful tool because it has a line which denotes an end to the measure measurement and then this button here which actually reads the exact measurement for you. So it's a great way for students to practice their virtual measuring. Along with that you can resize the ruler, obviously move it around to wherever you need it to be and also rotate it so that it's at the right angle. You can see in combination with a shape or shapes that this will be quite a useful mathematical tool. Another great tool that we have in the power tools is the protractor which operates in a very similar way. You can toggle the two uh, angles of the protractor and it, again it will read the exact angle for you created between the two lines. Uh, similarly you're able to rotate this, you're able to move it around as you please around the screen. Uh, beyond that we also have the record and playback function which I mentioned in the last video and also a simple uh, other tool involving the hand gesture being able to uh, have handwriting recognition for your text. Okay, so in this video I just wanted to show you some of the more advanced tools with the Zen Studio and uh, next tutorial I'll be able to show you some applications in the classroom and in the, uh, in the corporate boardroom. Thank you.